Spring is here, which means it's time for a little cleaning, and that includes cleaning out our beauty supplies. But how do you know when you should toss out the old ones? Yeah, I'd like to welcome back Mindy Green, beauty expert and owner of MG Beauty, who is here to help us determine the right time to throw out those old products so we can make room for the new ones. Thanks Hi, for being Mindy. here. Thank you for coming back. Good morning, ladies. Thank you for having me. So we have this uh, game that yes, we're going to yes. play, and we're excited. Right. So let me give you each a little basket. Okay, okay. I can tell products. the theme here. Yes. This is very festive. <laughs> I love it. Yes, mm. so just try to drop them in the basket you think is okay, the so right expiration Okay, so we're just going to look yes. at certain products and just drop right. them in, too. Okay, so one says 0 to 6 months, 12 to 18 months. 18 to 24 months and 20, 20 to 24 to It looks like they've months. got labels on this side too. Yeah. Perfect. So, okay, now we all yeah. can see it. Okay. Right. So, so when this, this is, expires. Yes. So, so mine. A foundation. I have Estee Lauder double wear. This is foundation. Yes. All right. So after I would say 12 to 18 months is when I would throw mine out. Drop it in. Okay. She's, she's yeah, not going to tell us till the end. Okay. I don't right? know. Okay. Best guess is okay. <laughs> this is a conditioner. I, mm -hmm. I feel like, I don't know. Uh, I'm gonna put, I'm just gonna go, it can last a while, <laughs> right? Hopefully. That's hair conditioner? Yes. Hair yeah, conditioner. like a... All right, so I have a beauty bronzer. palette, and yeah. this is a bronzer, I think, bronzer. actually, yes, that's and wearing this right you now. <laughs> okay, so <laughs> I've had this the for same about, one? yes, oh, and wow. it only costs like $12. Oh. So you can get it in Target. But anyways, I, um, I've had mines for a long time over six months, so I'm gonna go ahead and drop it into the 12 to 18 months. Okay. And okay. this is shampoo. I don't know, I, a shampoo and conditioner, I feel like, doesn't that last a while? It seems like it does. I don't know, okay. All right, so next I have mascara. Mascara, yes. And I gotta it stick with hard. it for yeah. 18 months because uh, like after a okay. year, so it's gonna go into this bucket. I like this bucket. Okay. I'm gonna put this, this is a, uh, a moisturizer. let's see, like a moisturizer. So that's for your face. Moisturizer, right? Yeah, I'm okay. gonna put here, I don't know why, okay. I'm just okay. gonna <laughs> try it. I right. got a few. It's fun to guess. All right, it's so more guess. blush and uh, blush. this. Yeah, it's, it's going to go in this. That's your favorite bucket. So yeah, <laughs> it's, it's just, I'm going to fill it up <laughs> right now. Bucket. And I'm going to I'm going to group these together. Okay, so right. these are the last ones I've got, like a, a lip gloss and a uh, liquid eyeliner. Lip, lip gloss, lipstick. liner. Oh, so like this gloss. is all makeup. I feel like makeup is around all the same. Really? Yeah. Okay. okay. So this is eyeshadow, and I think that's different. So I'm gonna go ahead and put it in the 18 to 24, and then lastly, that's like a little body lotion. Oh, body lotion. So, yeah, that's gonna go into the 18 to 24. Box. Okay. Yep. All right. So now, yeah. if you look on the back of some products, it'll have a little jar with the lid open, and that'll tell you about how long you can keep that product. Okay. Yes. Yeah, so if you look at, and I think we might have a visual. Okay. Just to kind of show you that, but you can see mm -hmm. there's like a little lid, and that's going to tell you the manufacturer, of course, is going to be the expert on their products. Mm -hmm. But you know, there's some general guidelines, like of course the hair, like you were talking about your shampoo and conditioner, like 24 months. It does. So that was yes. right. Yes. Oh, okay. Yes. Look at that. Yes. Look at that. Yes. Amazing. Okay. okay. Yes. And then we start getting into like the body moisturizers, kind of like that 18 yes. to 24. So. We did get the face. So, okay, I got okay, the yep, okay. moisturizers. Not doing too bad, not too bad. Okay, and then mascara, liquid dun, dun, dun. eyeliner. Mm -hmm. That's in that zero to six months. Okay, really? yes. zero to six months. Quick turnover on that. Once you put it on your eye, the clock starts ticking. Mm. Okay. Yes, yeah, so that's one of those things you should buy. I'd say less expensive if you can, okay, because so you we have either. to turn it over so quickly. Foundation about twelve months. Twelve okay. months. Okay. okay. Lipstick. We're talking about two years. Oh, roughly wow. lip wow. gloss though maybe more like a year unless it melts in your okay. pocket or goes through yeah. the wash yes. <laughs> <laughs> right you know, like, right. yeah and you know a lipstick it'll start to smell different mm -hmm. it'll look different it'll be real sticky real gummy you know if it's starting to go bad okay. you know um and then you get your lip liners maybe like a year your bronze bronzers and powder two years two mm -hmm. years yeah. Okay. yeah so that's roughly all right what you're so wow at. this bucket most of what i put in here <laughs> is right well, so know. Eyeshadow. Did you mention that when you were going through your list? Eyeshadow about two years. Two years. Okay. Yeah. yeah. All right. But you definitely want to think about things for the eyes that are liquid. Mm -hmm. That's what you want to toss very quickly. Well, and eyes are so sensitive too. Yes. I mean, I know, yeah. like, well, I have little kids, and so pink eye runs around the daycares, and like, mm -hmm. there's always like, you know, a, and when anything like that happens, you're supposed to like throw away all your makeup too, right? Oh, I mean, yeah. you not only just like yeah. making sure it's, you know, not expired, but making sure that like it's. 
it's gone. not full of bacteria <laughs> you know, yeah. like, exactly and your brushes. Right. Like, well, how often do you have to wash your brushes? I'm saying once a week. Once yeah, a week. Once a week. Yeah. You should be. Sometimes I get lazy and I, uh -huh. you know, stretch it to two weeks and then. Well, it's not bad, but I mean, if it, you're just using it a little safer, it's of course. It's time consuming. It is. And it is. it's. Makeup is expensive, you mm, know, so I try to hold on to what I can for however long. Um, I do like to, you know, go to some of the, the higher brands, depending yes. on what I'm doing and, and for what. But I noticed that, you know, it just sits on your face better, depending on how high you go. And so based on what we know now with, you know, how long things last, would you say that you would splurge on the things that last longer versus shorter? Or how do you know, you know, what would be a good purchase when it comes to your makeup? I definitely say foundation, concealer, those things, skin care, if you can afford to splurge, definitely mm. there. But okay. things you turn over quick, eyeliners, mascaras, you can find some really good options in the drugstore mm. for those, definitely. And sometimes the more expensive brands might own a less expensive brand. Yeah. So, you know, sometimes it'll be a similar product, just a little bit less expensive in the drugstore. So, let's say, what's the worst? You know, because I know I've been using some things way too <laughs> long. You know, you just hold on to it and you can't let it go. So, you know, what do I run the risk of? Oh, uh, well, I mean, definitely, like you were saying, eye infections. That mm -hmm. could definitely happen. Of course, you can get maybe a skin rash. That's possible. I mean, of course, longer term, you can maybe get acne, you know, skin kind of in irritations. So, yeah, especially with body washes, too. Yeah. Well, this was very helpful. <laughs> Thanks for uh, putting on so this fun questions. little activity yes, yeah. for us that's actually useful. I mean, yeah, it totally is good. Is. Perfect time to do it in spring. So <laughs> yes, we appreciate you, you being Betty. here. Thank you. And after the break, the pasta of the president, what the Bidens recently ordered and why it went viral next.